Hey guys, so as you know, our YouTube has been very quiet for the last few days. Same was on holiday and myself and Luke have been traveling since last Tuesday. So yeah, it's been hectic. We have been away on the road for a whole seven days straight. We were, I'll say we were first and go back and see what we're doing. We were in Norwich for two days. Then we were in London for two days and then we were in Birmingham for two days as well. Um, so yeah, it's been all over the place. It's been hectic, trains, buses, and plane mobiles, every single place, wherever we're going, you know, so. Yeah, so we were down in Norwich for Mirafit. So Mirafit's obviously one of our sponsors. You would have seen all the plates and stuff, the bars that we use in the gym from them. That was awesome. We had a full day shooting down there. They looked after us really nicely. Um, so all that content will be coming out in their social media channels. Really good fun, I thought it was good. Yeah, better than I thought it would be. Mm -hmm. And their uh, warehouse, that their HQ is much bigger than I thought. Mm. So yeah, fair play to Mirafit, they've gone from, you know, I kind of started in the last few years to yeah, a big, big name in the sport now. So yeah, keep keep doing what you're doing, Mirafit, bye. Yeah, so huge shout out to Mirafit, thank you for having us down there, guys. And then as Tom said, from Norwich, we got the train down to London on Friday, where we had the My Protein Labs event, which was pretty cool. Um, in a graffiti tunnel or something, I think it was, some guy did a kind of photo or a graffiti artwork of you that was pretty cool it's right now already <laughs> yeah someone's like scri scribbled on tom's right, face it's a graffiti tunnel so you expect mm. that but yeah it was cool like luke said graffiti tunnel i just love uh, i always love spray paint and to see the actual art people do it's unbelievable what they can do with a mm. spray paint bottle even that art they did on me it's mind-boggling what you can do with a bottle and stencils and stuff but yeah that was really good in my protein uh, we had talks of all different things relationships Overcoming obstacles, overcoming like autism, etc., etc. Uh, all different athletes there doing stuff, meet and greets. They had some games there, the mm -hmm. boxing bars. It was just a kind of good event, mm -hmm. just to I think, yeah, get back after lockdown as well. I think that's my protein's kind of first one as well since lockdown. So it's good to have myself, Eddie, Matt Dish Fitness, kind of the top names in the British kind of scene for my protein as well. So. Mm -hmm. oh, that was good. And if you want to have a look, check Eddie's channel as well because there's going to be a spicy wing. An extremely spicy wing challenge. Check out Tom's TikTok. Also, we both do TikTok now. I so. just want to say, Eddie Hall, I am never, ever going to accept your invite to dinner ever again because that was one of the worst days of my life. Oh, get it off. Oh my God. All right. <coughs> but the best because I was a few. <laughs> so, yeah, if you want to see any of our reactions, go on to the TikTok. Um, and then after London, Went to Birmingham, we had Sam filming with the Commonwealth Games, so that was pretty cool. We did six different events, what was it? Uh, gymnastics, oh. basketball, diving, diving, hockey, cricket, cricket and judo. judo. So that was that was amazing. So some of the athletes that were down teaching us how to do it, they're actually going to be competing in the Commonwealth Games. And a few of them had actually competed in Tokyo in the Olympics, which was amazing to see. So it was really busy, really hectic. We've only really trained once um, in the last week, which is obviously not the optimum for us. But at the moment, Tom talked about it. We're kind of having a bit more of a chilled year, trying to have some babies, um, which is super exciting. But we are back in the office today. It's Wednesday. We're flying back down to London tomorrow. Back in the office for less than 24 hours, uh, lads. Here we go. So we will get back into a bit more routine. Apologies, it's been a little bit... Um, we've been a little bit AWOL, but we are still here, still present. As always, thank you always for the support. It means an awful lot to us. Um, the new merchandise is going well. The shorts, there's new socks as well. The purple hoodie. Um, the dry robe will be coming out quite soon. We're just waiting for it to get shipped. Um, so yeah, lots of exciting times. Super excited to get back to training. Are you training today? I think so. I might. I'm a bit... Uh, I mean, getting flipped. We, we did this Commonwealth game, as Luke said, but the one I enjoyed the most was judo. And getting flipped over by like guys that I thought were never ever going to be able to push me off my feet. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap, I feel like I've been hit by a brick house about a hundred million times. Like, that was a good experience, but yeah, it was close. Uh, I'm never going to talk down to a judo guy ever again. So, yeah. in fact, I'm sorry, judo guys. I think it was uh, the coach was fit from Team Renegade yeah, he was cool. down in London. Um, and sorry, in Birmingham, sorry, down in Birmingham, which was awesome. So, huge shout out to those guys. Yeah, Thank that was so just much. a fun few days. And then, obviously, 
Yeah, buy the merchandise because I want to see every single person at the Fit Expo in Liverpool with a merch Tom, with a Stokeman Brothers merchandise on. He wants to see it with the Tom Stokeman. No, sorry, merch. <laughs> Stokeman Brothers merchandise. If not, I will let you drag you out by the neck and throw you out the expo. So it's your choice. So if you want to come to the Fit Expo in Liverpool, we will be there. But to get entry into the Fit Expo, you have to have some Stoke merchandise on you. That is a fact. A tattoo or a merchandise, your choice. So please buy our merchandise. So we will see you guys at the expo in a week or so. Goodbye. Love you. Stay safe. Smile. Stay safe. Oh, and don't forget to ring that little bell. Ding a ling a ling a ling.